Hi, my name is Hannah Sofka. I'm the producer and director of Beyond Iconic, a feature length documentary on the great photographer Dennis Stock. Dennis Stock may not ring a bell, but you've definitely seen his images of James Dean, Marilyn Monroe, Marlon Brando, jazz greats like Billy Holiday, Ella Fitzgerald, Miles Davis. Dennis Stock created some of the images that have defined the late 20th century, the United States, and all kinds of aspects of our culture. Dennis Stock wasn't just a brilliant photographer, he also was a remarkable personality and a person who could express his strong opinions very well. One of the things that'll happen when you watch Beyond Iconic is you will never look at photography the same way again. Beyond Iconic is complete and it had a great festival run. It was shown at Doc NYC at the IFC Center in New York City, at the Stars Denver Film Festival, at the Hot Springs Documentary Film Festival, and at the Sao Paulo International Film Festival in Brazil, where actually it was one of the audience selected finalists in the documentary category. It's also gotten great reviews. This film is, as they say, in the can. However, it needs one final boost so that it could reach broader audiences. In other words, I need that last bit of money so that the film can reach broadcast networks. The great thing about this is it's an opportunity for me to share this film with you before anyone else can have a copy and probably also before anyone else can see it. So please help out and it will be such a delight and pleasure to share this film with you. You're dealing with a miniaturized image that's two dimensional. So the power that you have to bring forth when you're collecting this image, yeah, when you're capturing it, has to be considerable. So the image becomes indelible. I just go out there and follow my nose. And if it ends up being iconic, so be it. It is not in my intention. I had a strong predisposition to jazz. Maybe I was born in past life in Africa. Bogart became my mentor in Hollywood. In the 60s, there was a revolution afoot in the United States. The United States has been an exotic landscape. If you want to dissect my work, I think that it's a marvelous way of saying, I've been here.